Hi, this is a quick tutorial showing you how to set up Cubase to communicate with Liquid Notes on a Mac. If there is no IAC bus installed on your computer, please watch our tutorial video about the installation of an IAC bus first. But now this is our track in Cubase and we want to manipulate it with Liquid Notes. So now we are first exporting the song as a MIDI file from Cubase. Then we're simply dragging the exported MIDI file onto the Liquid Notes window, like this. Now in the wizard, which is opening after the import, we choose Cubase as our sound output source. And then as we can see here, the result of the track type analysis is correct, so we click on finish. Now let's take a look at the instrument selection where we can find the output ports and output channels for each track. So for each track, we now have to assign each input port in Cubase to the corresponding output port in Liquid Notes. Simply put, the number of the input port of a track in Cubase has to match the number of the output port of the corresponding track in Liquid Notes. Liquid Notes assigns the ports to the tracks in an ascending order, and that's how it should be configured in Cubase 2. So track 1 should be listening to IAC bus number 1, track 2 to IAC bus number 2, and so on. As you can see here. Okay. And finally, we enable record for all tracks. And that's it then. The connection has been established. And when you play the song from Liquid Notes, you'll hear it through Cubase. Thanks for watching.